Welcome back, everyone. <clears throat> Boy, it looks like this Scissor Man mystery's really gone to this guy's head. <laughs> anyway, let's keep going. We're gonna die. That's gonna suck. Found out what the buttons do. Still not quite sure how to make this silly bitch run whenever I want her to, though. But nope, don't go to the bathroom. Just go over here. Let's go in here. Maybe. Laboratory, but the door's locked. Well, we don't... Helen's laboratory is on the second floor. Well, that's good. Yeah, I guess we'll go look for Helen, then. Can we go in here? Yes, we can. What do we got? We got boxes. Boxes are good. Boxes are good. Boxes have stuff in them. Food crumbs covered in ants. That's great. This is a place to hide? It's empty. It's a place to hide. Tools, but nothing's useful. This might be useful. You just said nothing was useful. Daffy bitch. Nothing strange inside. I want something I just defend myself with. Complex charts and graphs. What's this? Hint number two, hot diggity! Well, next time we die, I'll look at those. Locked. Okay, well, let's mosey. Let's head upstairs, then. You also can't use the same hiding space too often, or else he'll figure you out and kill you anyway. I seem to vaguely remember that from when I played this once when I was... Oh, right after it came out, I would have been about 16 or so. This game scared the crap out of me. It's one of those games where you can't really fight the antagonist. That's why I wanted to do it. It starts off so slow, but... Let's look for Helen's lab. I think this is it. Yeah, yeah, this is the lab. Huh. Well, the mask is still here. Danny's desk. There are trading cards and small toys. What a loser. Files on cases of mental illness. Harris's desk. There are many cutout articles on the clock tower case scattered all over it. There's even a picture of me here. Oh, Harris, please don't be the bad guy. That looks like something. Best. There's stuffed animals and a spray can. Oh. Can of mace. Take it with you, stupid! <sighs> I guess I'll just remember it if I have to fight him in here. I can use it then, I guess. Very organized. There's a key! Yay, keys! We have the office key. Professor Barton's desk. There's a telephone! Well, the last one was dead too, stupid. Now we'll check out the therapy room. It's open! Yay! Oh, really? That's unpleasant. Do we know who it is? Ah! Dead peoples. Come on, walk it off, sissy. And she vomits on the floor. Thanks, Jen, that's awesome. Good to see you in the Halloween spirit. Patience charts are collected here. 
good for them. Ah, the scissors are gone. Any bottles of medicine? Cheap table. Okay. Well, let's go get killed by a scissor man. Wait, wait, wait. Can we? got his ass. I'm gonna whop him with this fire extinguisher. It's gonna be awesome. Come on, stupid. Look at the fire extinguisher. Don't look at Scissor Man. Look at the fire extinguisher. Come on. You can do it. Come on. Whop him with the fire extinguisher. Didn't work. Really, game? Anyway. Yeah, if you hang out for too long, he just shows up. Forget about that. Main character is determined by the number of times Harris is spoken to in the corridor during the prologue. Mm-hmm. Oh, so that's how we ended up as Jennifer. If a certain item is not picked up in scenario one, then the best ending will not occur. Ooh, that's no good. I certainly hope I picked it up. Let's see where continue takes us. I may not have to, be to do the save load state thing. Hmm, he's after us. Let's go upstairs. Keep running, you idiot. Upstairs. Upstairs. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. I believe in you. I believe in the you that believes in you. He's clipping through the wall! Damn you, woman. Okay, please die, please die. Uh, under the bed. Under the bed? Above the bed? Ah, under the bed. Good. We might be okay. Go away! Don't look under the bed! I think he knew where we were. Well, that's unfortunate. That's nice, I don't have to worry about saving the state. Continues awesome. Okay, um. Can we hide under the other bed? <laughs> ah! We'll go up. You'll never find me up here. I'll hide like a scared chicken. Go away! He's creepy! Seriously? We have evaded the Skizzer Man. Anything else in here? Campus is creepy with everyone gone. Bunk beds, no one's using them. Over here. Cosmetics on the table. There's something written here. Hit number three. Oh, nice. Very cool. Very cool. Okay. 
So we got a ladder key, whatever the hell that's for. Can we try this door? Yeah, Fierro's laboratory. Now we can actually look at stuff instead of just running around in a blind panic. Check out the men's room. I thought Scissor Man was in there. So you open the door. Idiot. Her hands are slippery with blood. I thought I heard music. This is really creepy with headphones. There's not much on this floor. I ain't touching the elevator. You got me once with that game. No more for you. What's in here? A lot of computers. A simple table. Uh, I'm afraid there's not going to be anything useful in here. Well, fine, don't touch it then. See if I give a damn. Tools here. Or if it's being repaired. Personal computers on the table. I'm not very good with computers. Okay then. Hey, whatever makes you happy. Uh, let's head up to the next floor, I guess. I do remember if you hang out here for too long, he, if you're using the elevator to get away from him, because obviously he's not in the elevator if he's chasing you. He'll uh, he'll cut the power off. <laughs> it's creepy as hell. Oh, this is not good. An emergency ladder. It's like a fire ladder. <gasps> nope. It's locked, so I guess it can't be used in an emergency either. We have this ladder key. Is it safe? Well, would you rather stay in here with the scissor murderer? I know I sure as hell don't want to. I don't know how the rest of that song goes. <laughs> Run away! Woohoo! We're alive! No, I'm good. I've got quick saves. What the is going on? We haven't even solved the last case yet. Now, another mass murder. And again, you're saying the murderer. Is a monster with a tiny pair of scissors. This guy's an asshole. Scissor man's back, man. You me. Well, whether you exist or not, you should go home and rest. You got a policeman posted outside your house. Yeah, that worked real well for the security guy. Thank you, Inspector. It's a pink lady. That's Assistant Inspector. <laughs> what a loser. <laughs> oh, God. Can we uh, talk to Helen? Jennifer. Helen. Jennifer. It was true. It was a scissor man. I believe you. He's just being stubborn. I heard that, Teach. Anyway, if it is him, we'll have to figure out some way to destroy him. We can do it. Yes. If I'm in the mood, there are many, many, many endings to this game. I may go ahead and play them all for you. Um, let's see, what should we do now? Uh, police station, newspaper company. We should probably go talk to Edward. Let's go talk to Edward. 